happenings, global happenings today. We communicate. We analyze global news. Stay tuned. Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to Global Happenings Today YouTube channel. It's no longer news that Mazen Abikano have been denied that much needed dream come true. And South South Easterners have been looking forward to this Christmas gift that will change their story and narrative for a long time. But alas, that will not be one. It's indeed we're having you know made their stand very open, having made a public stand and even politically asked for favor from the sitting gov president. They are shocked that their requests were not granted, and this is their reaction. Then, of course, there's one man who are proven to be a true man who doesn't care what tribe you come from. If he smells injustice of any kind, he doesn't mind. In fact, it's a man, one man army. I'm talking about a Sowari, Omoyele Sowari. Hate him, love him. He is one man that stands for Nigerians. Please give it to him. Give him his flowers on this. He owns it. He deserves it. He comes out each time he hears any form of injustice. He doesn't even care if he's safe. But he will do it just because he needs to do this thing. And I, I, I really thumbs, thumb up to him. He has been doing this consistently for many years. He has been following up on the issue of Mazen Abikano. And this time around, you will get to see the video. What transpired in court what he went through in the hands of the police officers and security agencies, DSS, and how it all went by. Again, I salute the man, Omoye Lissowari, on this. But let's find out what Ohanes and Nibo is saying concerning this. But before we do that, kindly subscribe to our channel. Click on the red subscribe button beside the bell notification icon. Please go ahead. Click on it to get notified as soon as you update our channel on YouTube. Don't also forget to like and share so that um, YouTube could, you know, she uh, have more coverage now. According to the news, the Apex Igbo Social Cultural Organization, Hanes and Debo Worldwide, has expressed shock and disbelief after the Supreme Court nullified the Court of Appeals judgment ordering the release of Namde Kanu's leader of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB. Now, the court held that the government adoption of Kanu from Kenya was illegal and at the same time said he should face his trial, which means the government will benefit from his wrongs. But the judgment, Dr. Alex Obona, Hannes, the spokesman, said in an interview. Now, what Obona, Obona further stated that Ohanese will convene to analyze the ruling and its implications for both the security of Southeast and the well-being of its people. On Friday morning, the Supreme Court, in a unanimous decision by a five-member panel, acknowledged the illegality of Kanu's extradition from Kenya. But however, they, they, they ruled that this does not prevent the trial court from continuing in its proceedings. Now, the court also criticized the trial court's revocation of Kanu's bill after its 2017 escape triggered by the inversion of his home by security forces, which resulted in casualties. Now, Kano, initially arrested in Lagos in 2015, has been in custody of Department of State Services DSS since June 2021. Wow. Now, that's, that's, this is uh, really honestly, this is one news that South Easterners were not expecting. They were expecting... Um, Good news. They were expecting that um, Kanu would have been set free. But then again, let's see uh, what Omoye Nisori did in court today. That is what I proud. This man is a one-man army. And I salute his doggedity. I salute his bravery. And I salute his boldness and his fairness. On matters that originally does not even affect him directly. But indeed, uh, this is a case of Oyan Yalawani, even though he's not from the Southeast. Let's watch the what transpired in court today when Omoye Lissoro tried, you know, going into court to hear that verdict of um, Mazen Abdekan. We'll come back. Why, why would you say no access for sure? Eh? Which, which order? Who gave you the order? Who gave you the order? Don't, 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 don't. Who gave you the order that I should not, I should not have access to, to the... Don't camera out there. Yeah. What, what, who gave you the order? I want to call somebody. Don't, no, no, no. Don't no, camera out there. I will beg you for... Organize yourself. Why are you camera on it? Organize yourself. Now you're you supposed to behave yourself. Organize yourself. Don't use battle. Organize yourself. Oh, yeah? Move, move, move. Organize yourself. Why, why would you want to check move, it, take move, my move. phone? Tony! What do you want to take my phone for? Uh, uh, well, come back, do your work. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I was uh, returning from uh, the Supreme Court of Nigeria where there was supposed to be a ruling today regarding uh, the freedom of uh, 
Nandu Kano, as uh, the leader of uh, Biafra, who has been in detention, illegal detention in Nigeria after he was extraordinarily renditioned from Kenya uh, almost uh, uh, two and a half years ago. And uh, it's so shameful uh, that uh, the Nigerian security services mounted, uh, you know, checkpoints at the uh, at the entrance of the Supreme Court. Twice I tried to enter the Supreme Court through different uh, gates, they refused. Come down. Revise back. This is the judges who are about revise back. Who is the judges? The judges not. Who is the judges? Who is the judges? We are saying who is the judges? Who is the judges? Is there anyone there? Revise back. Just relax. Revise, just revise back. You say who is the judges? Revise back. They made it clear that uh, there's an order from above as usual that said I cannot attend to this uh, uh, ruling. We are waiting, and uh, I just worry that he may not get justice. This is a very early day, or early morning sign that they might have something up their sleeves. But I hope I'm wrong for the first time today. But regardless of what they do, Kanu must be free. He must be granted his freedom because he's not a criminal. And we know who the criminals are in this country. They're the ones running the country, sadly. So that's, uh, that's uh, a report from the Supreme Court. All right, welcome back. You have heard what uh, Yelly said. Uh, he said it the way it is. Did everything he could to go in, but I wonder why he was at the top. I'm really not comfortable with Yelly always coming into court, be that as it may. Uh, I know that probably one day, uh, Mazinal Khan will be released, and some of these videos he would love to play, uh, play them. So then, like, uh, your your yearly is even related to uh, uh, Mazinal Khan, but he has been suddenly being consistent. Some South Eastern have said, "I've given up on Mazinal Khan," but really each trial case, trial, you see yearly there trying to come in there. You see, you always be bouncing him. Okay, I guess that's a good wrap it up. Let's discuss this. What's your take? On the standpoint of Wuhanis in Libo, would they do anything differently? Is there hope that Mazin Khan will be released this year, even before Christmas? Or would we should is it going to be a case of trying to file for a bill? And if eventually we get to that, I don't see Mazin Khan coming back to this country anytime soon. I guess that's going to wrap it up. Let's meet in our conversation. What's your take? Have a nice time. God bless you. So the Supreme Court. Twice I tried to enter the Supreme Court through different uh, gates. They refused. Revise back. This is the judges who are about revise back. Who is the judges? The judges not. Who is the judges? Who is the judges? We are saying who is the judges? Yes. Who is the judges? Is there anyone there? Revise back. Just relax. Revise, just revise back. You say who is the judges? Revise back. They made it clear that uh, there's an order from above as usual that said I cannot attend to this. Uh,